Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I'm Yun Zhu, a PhD student in computer science from Zhejiang University. It's a great honor to show our work, uh, graph control, adding conditional control to universe graph pre-trained models for graph domain transfer learning. Uh, first, let's review transfer learning. It will reuse pre-trained models on new tasks, which can save time and improve results. It has achieved greater successes in the NLP and the CV domains. And because both of them use a standardized vocabulary across different data samples, like tokens in NLP and pixels in CV. However, in the graph domain, graphs rep rep uh, represent more complex relationships, making it hard to create a unified graph vocabulary. Uh, this making uh, uh, this makes transferring preaching graph models from source to target data uh, difficult. This is because graph can be very different from one another in how they show information. For example, a graph from a social network might show uh, information like how old someone is or how uh, tall they are. But a graph showing uh, connections between research papers might just have a list of important words from each paper. Since these graphs show their information differently, it's hard to get a general model that learned from one type of graph to do well on another. To avoid this, some methods focus only on structural information, which can share across different graphs. By doing this, might make us missing important details. For instance, in graphs about research papers, we might miss the what the papers are actually about, without in a lack of specificity. On the other hand, some methods designed to uh, pre-train and fine-tune on the same graph can understand all the detailed information, like what's in those papers. These methods lose. Uh, these methods achieve specificity but lose transferability. Uh, in summary. Existing methods face a uh, transferability specificity dilemma, which is uh, the difficulty of applying the same methods to various graphs while also taking advantage of the unique and useful node attributes within each graph at the same time. To address these challenges, we introduced a novel module designed for the efficient deployment of uh, pre trained models on downstream datasets in Spider Control Night. Our designed module is compatible with current preaching models. It uses the transferable capabilities of preaching uh, graph models and integrate target node attributes into these models. Make sure important details from the new data are included. This module consists of two components, conditional generation module and graph control module. Firstly, let me introduce the conditional generation module. It aims to align the target node attributes into the same space of pre-trained input, like uh, structural information. Uh, specifically, we will use some kernel functions to calculate future distance in this work. We simply use a cosine similarity distance to evaluate the distance of two nodes in future space, and then use a threshold to discrete the attribute distance matrix, which is better compatible with adjacency matrix. Uh, we use the future adjacency matrix as a condition input to the graph control module. Uh, this module consists of two MRP zero, uh, initialized to zero and one trainable copy of the pre-trained model. For the target data, its structural information is fed into the frozen pre-trained model, same to the pre-training phase. The generated uh, condition is then fed into the graph control module, where the first zero initialized MRP transforms the uh, condition into their vectors. This is subsequently combined with the structural information, ensuring that the initial input to the trained copy is aligned with the uh, pre-trained phase. The output of the trained copy uh, then passes through the second zero initialized MRP, mapping the output to zero vectors which are later added to the output from the frozen model, thereby maintaining consistency with the pre-training model's output at the start. Lastly, the loss is calculated and uh, through optimization, the MRP gradually adjusts its parameters from zero to incorporate relevant downstream attributes 
while leaving out harmful noises during、uh, fine tuning. In addition to standard fine tuning, our approach is also adoptable to graph pump tuning in a few short scenario. For example, adopting the GPF framework, a learnable prompt vector is、uh, randomly initialized and added to the input graph, while the tunable copy、uh, remains unchanged during the prompt tuning phase. The diagram illustrates the pipeline. First, we、uh, train our model on a large amount of source data using a pre-trained method,、uh, focus on structural information. Then, for targeted data that includes important node attributes, we input structural information into the frozen pre-trained model and fed and feed well-designed conditions into the trainable copy. These components are linked through zero initialized MLPs. Which gradually expand parameters from zero to incorporate variable downstream attributes, and safeguard against detrimental noise during fine tuning. Through extensive experiments, our method demonstrates the best performance, emphasizing the importance of achieving transferability and specificity simultaneously. Furthermore, our approach can be applied to most pre-trained methods to significantly. Uh, enhance the performance when deployed on de-、uh, targeted data. Our approach not only improves performance but also notably reduces train time in downstream applications compared to traditional GNN methods. For ablation study, our method、uh, with a soft condition also underperforms, highlighting the significance of aligning the format of condition and the input during、uh, pre-training. And graph control, we thought zero MLPs lagged behind graph control by a comparable margin, indicating the importance of、uh, zero MLPs in linking the frozen model and、uh, the tunable copy to avoid、uh, detrimental noise during fine tuning. And、uh, simply, con- cat- uh, simply concatenation achieves super bar,、uh, resulting on most data sets, emphasizing the risks of overfitting when training from scratch on limited data. Uh, the main contribution of our work can be summarized as follows:、uh, Firstly, we identify the、uh, transferability specificity dile- dilemma in graph transfer learning.、Uh, secondly, we design a novel deploy- deployment module to address this dilemma. And lastly, extensive、uh, experiments show that the proposed module significantly enhances enhances the ad- adaptability of Pre-trained、uh, models on downstream datasets and can be seamlessly integrated with existing pre-trained models. And thanks for your listening.、Uh, more details about our work can be found on these links.